hi guys welcome back to the channel today we are going to talk about flights to Jamaica and some some mistakes that were made in the past that that are holding back Jamaica right now in terms of tourism now one is the flights to Jamaica if Jamaica had the availability of flights to bring 10 million passengers to Jamaica a year they would bring they would the, the passengers would come what's holding back tourism in Jamaica right now is the availability of flights to Jamaica which brings us up to Air Jamaica it was a huge mistake to shut down Air Jamaica and if I remember correctly I don't think the government wanted to they were forced to shut it down in order to get a loan from the IMF if anybody can remember the details you can leave a comment in the section below but the government needed a loan from the IMF and the IMF said one of the conditions I get in the loan is that you have to shut down Air Jamaica now Air Jamaica was running at a loss in terms of profit and loss but when you factor in the amount of tourists that Air Jamaica used to bring to Jamaica the money that the tourists spend in Jamaica I'm not sure if overall when you look at the big picture though that that was such a good move but let's look at today today Jamaica has thousands of hotel rooms under construction as a matter of fact Jamaica has 30,000 hotel rooms and another 20,000 under construction and these are billion dollar hotel investments so the, the hotel companies love Jamaica they see the potential in Jamaica and guess what they're making money in Jamaica that's why they are expanding and new ones coming but the one thing holding back the tourism industry is the number of flights Jamaica does not have a national carrier anymore because Air Jamaica was a national carrier and they closed down and so foreign comp other airlines like American Airlines and JetBlue and Caribbean Airways are the ones that fly passengers into Jamaica but they are not a priority for these airlines if Air Jamaica was still around you would have so many more flights coming into Jamaica so that was a major mistake another mistake made read the tourism is the Ian Fleming International Airport now they upgraded the Bosco Bell aerodrome to an international airport but they never extended the runway the runway is like 1100 meters compared to 3060 meters at the Sangster International Airport so that will give you an idea of the limitations that that airport has now the Sangster International Airport has over 40,000 flights a year coming into Jamaica over 40,000 Ian Fleming has two flights a week because the airport is limited via the runway so it was a huge mistake not extending the runway when they upgraded the airport now look at what's happening with tourism in Jamaica the Sangster International Airport almost 6 million passengers a year and more coming because almost every week another flight another route is put on to Jamaica because Jamaica is the number one tourist destination in the Caribbean Jamaica is doing better than all other Caribbean countries and it's mostly the Sangster International Airport that's bringing in the passengers 
the cheap Norman Mann International Airport in Kingston is the second option because it's far from the tourist areas. The Sangster International Airport brings in 85% of all the tourists into Jamaica because they all go between Negril and Ocho Rios. Those That's the major spot for tourists. Now, can you imagine if you had an international airport in Ocho Rios that could that could bring in even more flights into the country the difference it would make that if Ocho Rios had a, a international airport that could land those big planes do you know how many more flights would come into Jamaica so it was definitely definitely a mistake not to extend the runway All right, guys, let us know what you think about the expansion, not expanding the runway at Ian Fleming and also All right, morning. You guys take electronic payment now? Yes. All right, they charge a fee when you do it? No additional fee? All right, cool. So guys let us know what you think leave your comments in the section below all right guys have a good day